The Pikeville store in Delhi has been around longer than any of us. The store has been here since probably 1906 or 1907. Dwayne Wilkerson's grandfather ran it in the 40s. Dwayne and his wife Connie bought it in 1990. That's when we started our little journey. It had a reputation for good eats. Cheeseburgers and moon pie banana pudding. And you had to have both when you came. If you could hold both, you, you had to have both. <laughs> Their lives changed. October the 19th, uh, 2016. Their 37-year-old son, who was going to take over when they retired, had stage four liver cancer. We just felt like at that time that we, we needed to be with Jason. They locked the door and held on to hope. And we were just going to close until he got better. Jason died 10 weeks later. Our life come to a standstill. But time marches on. They decided to sell. Let someone else experience the friendship and the fun and, that we've had all these years. Burgers are sizzling again on the grill. What can I bring you all that's not already sitting on the table? Scott and Lisa Berry bought the Pikeville store and grill. They reopened in September 2017. Things were great until COVID hit. We were closed almost two months a couple of years ago with all that, but now for the most part, our business is back. I actually have been coming here since I was a baby. Actually, you're right up down the road. Mary Schmidt now works here. It's been here since the 1900s, and I mean, it's a little hole in the wall. A lot of people love the little hole in the wall. You don't see much. And not just from North Alabama. People from Arizona, Illinois, New York. New Hampshire, Montana, Arizona. All over. Customers have come back, but one thing is missing. We had Buck, the, the famous yellow pikeville dog that was about, we, we think, 18 years old. And had been out here at this restaurant since he was a puppy. He left a few months ago and hasn't come home. We think Buck has probably crossed the Rainbow Bridge and not with us anymore. There's a memorial outside the front door. Oh, he was the best fed dog in Jackson County without question and probably the most famous. Where Buck used to lay to greet everyone. Well, we will miss him a lot. Like Buck, folks know where to find good food. We got the big cut bologna, and cheese, hot dogs with the red slaw. So we've got a variety of items. Salads if you're on a diet. Michelle Allen also grills a lot of burgers. Probably about four or five hundred or so. Yeah, we do quite a bit. But save room for desserts. That's the banana pudding right there. That's kind of what we're known for is the moon pie banana pudding. We sell quite a bit of it. Don't even bother asking for the recipe. It's a secret recipe. Go back from the original owners. Yeah, I've heard that. Honoring the past. Coming out. This place is so important and we've always thought to the local community, uh, it's just much better off with Pikeville Store and Grill being open than closed. Moving into the future. In Scottsboro, Jerry Hayes, News 19.